thousands of years, Americans have looked for answers to life's difficult questions. The original patented and proven program of Valhalla's finest deity, Thor. Treasure awaits you, but beware of your women, folk. Treachery is deep in her. By the coming of the spring, she shall be no more. Thor changed my life! Author of two best-selling self-help books translated from the original runic into 25 languages, Thor has helped millions realize their dreams. Beware the trap set by the frost giants. Carry Yes, was pleased and would like to meet you again. Is that a good thing? Of course, although I'm starting to think that Diaz was responsible for our unfortunate loss. What makes you say that? One does not wave accusations at a man like Diaz. I'm merely thinking out loud. No matter. I have a proposal that you could profit. I don't have time to run more errands, Cortez. I would have thought a man with such dangerous dates would be hungry for opportunities. Please, Tommy, at least hear me out. Go on. I have a buyer for a piece of military hardware that is being taken through town. Pick it up for me, and once you get it, I want you to call me immediately. Then... Throughout my career, my coach pumped me so full of steroids and hatred, I couldn't feel pain. Shoot, I even break my own leg for fun. They made me play when I... Fit for football and sticking it to the main. Using only a 400 pound duffel bag, luxurious gym, massive intakes of steroids, and a personal oxygen mask, you will be amazed as all those pounds fall off and flabs turn to muscle. Hell, you'll want to whip some ass because you'll be fighting fit. You'll learn how to argue with officials, beat up enormous men, break legs, and lose weight, especially in the brain. BJ's Fit for Football, out now on beta and VHS. Remember, to win a game of football or life, you have to annihilate everything in your path in a blind range. More mood swings than your present life. Hello, I am Fernando Martinez, and this is Emotion. When I first come to Vice City, I feel all lonely, a man on the outside, a foreigner. Then I say, Fernando, you like to talk a lot. So I get a well-paid job on the radio and begin to make my name as a successful DJ. Now I'm not so lonely, but I never forget my roots. I never forget, and so I always have a soft spot for foreigner. I've been waiting his next. Mm. So Yes, was pleased and would like to meet you again. Is that a good thing? Or dialectical materialism. Isn't it pleasant to have a patronizing voice on the radio? That's right, Michelle. With the way things are going under Reagan, at any moment the unwashed Huns from the Midwest could descend upon Vice City and enslave the poets and postal workers and force us to watch network programming. That is a frightening thought. But like many things in life, you can throw money at something and feel better about yourself. VCPR is your public radio station, but you have to open your wallet. Happy now. That's right. If you pledge at the $1,000 level, you'll get tickets for In the Future There Will Be Robots at the Vice City Arts Center. People who see that show say it's difficult to put into English. That must mean it's spectacular. Yes, but if you don't give money to VCPR, we could be thrown back to the Stone Age. Liberals will be set on fire in the streets. Give now. 
Let's return to pressing issues. Over to you, Maurice, in the studio. Useless, talentless asshole. You're correct. He is an asshole. I love those guys. Really professional and living proof that all of the best talent isn't on commercial networks. These people do it for love because they have integrity, just like me. around here a guy can get a drink. Early man, as seen in the cave of Las Coles in France, questioned the morality of making the mammoth extinct. I think we all know what happened there. Is it society's job? Yes, was pleased and would like to meet you again. Is that a good Where the sun sets, there you will find the village. Pillage! Plunder and burn all that you find! And if you order now, you'll receive four subliminal tape series, so you gain wisdom of the gods while sleeping. Accept the crystal cup. At the feast, beware the dwarf. Thor's personal Norse power program. Call now. 866 Pillage. That's 866 Pillage. Hi, I'm BJ Smith, football player, businessman, and father of 18 adorable kids. Throughout my career, my coach pumped me so full of stirs and hatred, I couldn't feel pain. Shoot, I even break my own leg for fun. They made me play when I was ill or injured, and that was because I'm a little more than a piece of meat to them. And now, you can too, with BJ's Fit Foot Football. I'll take you through all the necessary steps to get fit for football and sticking it to the main. Using only a 400 pound duffel bag, luxurious gym, Remember, to win a game of football or life, you have to annihilate everything in your path in a blind rage. Yes, was pleased and would like to meet you again. Is that a... 
another like family. Okay, so let me get this straight. Like, my brother is a cockroach, and my dad is a pigeon, and my mom is a fly. Is that right? Well, sort of genicalistically speaking, but you bang on, love. And you know what that also means? Uh, no. That you could legally speak to marry any animal you wanted and have kids. Unless you're married already, babe. You ain't married, are you? No, I just split up for my boyfriend. He didn't like me being on the radio. Whatever. I said I sounded stupid. Well, that's my point, love. I mean, imagine if you'd been out dating a wolf or a cute little bear. He'd protect you and stuff. You're an aide to keep out intruders, but he wouldn't mind you being on the radio. He wouldn't mind a bit. Why not? Wolves and deers have no concept of jealousy of someone else's success. That's the genetistic variation between Homo erectus and spider monkeys. Jealousy and fur and stuff. Oh. Oh, indeed, sweet thighs. Oh, indeed. Would you like Mr. Zoo to tell you something else? Yeah. Everything you learned in school was a lie, babe. A lie. Take virology, for instance. You were told sharks are dangerous, right? Yes. Cobblers, babe. They're frightened of you. They ain't gonna... Convoy! Halt! What's up with the gunner? Don't know, sir. We're taking enemy fire! Like a swimming puppy, real affectionate and stuff. Okay, I'll try that. You should, love, you really should. Let me tell you something else. Go on, go on. Well, this is something for the guys out there, really. You know, with a girl, right, you ain't got a clue. I mean, a female human, when she's on heat, right, and ready to mate, looks identical to a female human when she ain't on heat. And would throw a drink over your face if you grab her behind and start trying anything intimate. You can't tell the difference. I know that only too well, but take a forker monkey from the jungles of the Philip. Because you're the same! Well... God, the world is so complicated. There are also lots of tiny differences between animals. Fancy positions! Yes. It's an animal which has other animals which are quite a bit like it. A dog is a species, but a cat isn't, because there's lots of cats. However... I'm getting a little confused here. Why don't we take a break and when we come back, take some phone calls because all the buttons are really flashing all of a sudden. You're on K-Chat. The science of evolution has uncovered many of life's mysteries, like tadpoles or the pyramids. But the mystery of the armpit remains. What's it for? Why is it hairy? And why do men have nipples? But one thing is for certain, the armpit smells bad. Luckily, there's pit bombs. 
It's like napalm for your skin or Agent Orange on your sweat glands. Pit Bomb stops unwanted bodily functions in their tracks. It's as effective as sending GIs into a peasant village. When you're fighting the war against personal hygiene, bring out the heavy artillery. This Friday night, it's the incredible sitcom that has captured America's heart and given the whole country a new catchphrase. I'm 42! Just the five of us. After a mix-up at the adoption agency, the Chesterfields came home with three zany new house guests. Jimmy, tidy your room and go to bed. I'm so sick of this. I keep telling you I've got a rare disease. I look 12, but I'm a 42-year-old investment banker. I want to go out and get laid. Oh, yeah, and I'm Santa Claus. Now, tidy your room. Asshole. 